Hello everyone. In this video, we have this nice plane geometry problem and we have to find angle X and then angle Y. But before we begin, as always, pause the video and try first. And if you are new here, consider subscribed and also don't forget to like this video. Now let's get started. Now the question is saying that triangle BCG is an isosceles triangle. So line BC is the same as line BG. Okay. So it means that the angle over here is the same as the angle over here, okay? Then line BG is parallel to line AF, okay? So the angle over here is the same as this angle, that is corresponding angle. So this angle is also X degrees. And since triangle BCG is an isosceles triangle, the angle over here is also X degrees. Okay, now the sum of interior angle of a triangle is 180 degrees. So we have x plus x plus 36 degrees is equal to 180 degrees. Okay, so we have 2x is equal to 180 minus 36. So we have 2x is equal to 180 minus 36 is 144. Now, dividing each side by 2, we have x to be 144 divided by 2 is 72 degrees, okay? So, this angle over here is 72 degrees, then this angle is also 72 degrees, okay? So, what it means is that the angle over here is also 72 degrees, okay? So, we have been able to find x. Now we are left with y. So how can we find y from this triangle? Now to find y, let's go ahead and then sum this whole angle and then this angle over here and lastly this angle because the sum of interior angle of a triangle is 180 degrees. So we have 72 plus 2y plus 36 plus y is equal to 180 degrees okay so simplifying this we have 2y plus y is 3y plus 72 plus 36 is 108 and this is equal to 180 so we have 3y is equal to 180 minus 108 okay so we have 3y is equal to 180 minus 108 is 72 okay so let's go ahead and divide each side by three so that this three will cancel this now we have y is equal to 72 divided by three is 24 so we have y to be 24 degrees okay so what it means is that this angle over here is 48 degrees okay and then this angle is 60 degrees now let's go ahead and then sum the three angles to see whether it is up to 180. So we have 72 plus 60 plus 48. 72 plus 60 is 132. Then 132 plus 48 is equal to 180. Okay. So we have X to be 72 degrees and we also have Y to be 24 degrees. I hope you found this video useful. Please give it a thumbs up and also don't forget to subscribe to this channel. Thanks a lot for watching. See you again on the next video.